I went to the emergency room, and in the emergency room, they diagnosed me that as, as I ruptured my appendix. So I was rushed to a hospital on Christmas Eve, and unfortunately, I was laid on my back for about seven weeks. That resulted in a, um, in a sacral wound in my lower back, and that needed wound care because it, I, it became infected while I was hospitalized, and R3 was recommended. They send us a referral, um, the front desk, Administrators will uh, give you a call and they will ask you your insurance information and what time and what would work for you best for an appointment. Uh, they will get you into a scheduled appointment time and you'll come in and see our provider. Our provider will go over your medical history and kind of what, you know, what's going on. Once you reach our point, we are stepping in a more advanced role because your wound has stalled for some reason so we have to take more aggressive treatments to heal your wound quickly. So along with wound care I also preach to them about the hyperbarics therapy. Hyperbarics is it's explained in its name so if you break down the word hyperbarics hyper means elevated baric means pressure so that's basically what we do we do we deal with pressure. Once I come into my treatment uh, this, you know, um, they'll check my temperature real fast at the front desk, and then you know I'll proceed back for my hyperbaric. Patients come back to me. I give them a little bit of a briefing, uh, let them know what they're going to experience, and kind of walk them through what their day was going to look like. You'll be required to get out of your your normal clothes and get into a gown. From there, you know, you'll they'll set you into a small bed, which they'll, which they'll give you a blanket and a sheet. Um, you'll climb into the bed. And then what they'll do is they'll, they'll push you into the chamber. The chamber is a clear plastic tube and treatments usually last about two hours. So when you start the gauges, you'll feel the air pressure build. So what happens is, is with the pressure, we shrink the oxygen molecule to about a quarter of its normal size. And then thus effectively, we can, we can fit more oxygen into the system. It no longer relies on the red blood cell to carry it through the system at pressure. So it now free floats through the plasma and it can diffuse into the tissues easier. So the body's really smart about knowing where the oxygen needs to go and just the healing effects of oxygen and the getting into the tissues to make them happier. That's kind of what happens. And you'll feel your ears, you know, kind of feel funny in your ears, but it's kind of like when you go up in an airplane or if you go high altitude and, and you know, in a mountainous area, you know, but you, you'll quickly adjust. The assistant will they'll put on a movie, your favorite movie, and that will help, you know, treatments are usually two hours, so you'll have more than enough time to watch a movie or keep, catch up on your favorite soap opera or your favorite, you know, teleseries. It's like laying on your couch at home. You just, you get to watch TV, you hang out and just watch it. And by the time you're done, you, it's, it goes by so quick. And then once that is, they'll, they'll pull you out of the chamber and that'll be the end of treatment. We've healed a lot of wounds. Uh, that people have had for um, anywhere from four to 20 years. And just seeing that these patients get their lives back is, is awesome. It's gonna speed up your wound and it may even help you with other areas you may have them, such as sleep and perhaps your diabetes. When I first started hyperbaric, my A1C was 7.2. When I finished, it was 5.4. Here, it's, you're part of the family. So the moment you step in the door, we're gonna treat you like you're one of us. These staff, they're extremely friendly. They're extremely professional. Uh, they always made me feel warm and welcome each and every day that I came in for treatment. And I received 10 months, 195 treatments. And all 195 treatments I received, oh, always the same, warm, caring, professional. I feel that they saved my life. Without their care, I most definitely would have been hospitalized again from my wound and I may not be standing here, you know, speaking with you today if it wasn't for R3. So I, I just want to thank R3 for everything they've done. Mm -hmm.